Libra. Happy birthday, darling. I'm gonna leave those there. Let's see what your first card is. Let's see what our first card is. Ooh. Moon and Cancer. So this is a four, which is talking about your emotional awareness. And it's also talking about emotional complacency, right? And you guys could be feeling very intuitive, right? So something might have been in, something may have been handed to you that initiated a feeling that was your intuition or empathy. And you may know something or you might be identifying with a new feeling because the moon in cancer is always ident identifying with a new feeling. Therefore, the emotional stability is always changing as there are three cups here and this is a four, but this extra cup is always appearing. Every time you look at this card, it's always appearing. So it's always a new feeling, right? Oh, here's another feeling, here's another feeling. And it's trying to control those feelings, right? Because the fours are talking about control and it's talking about wanting and needing to control. And I was talking about taking the emotions out of something, right, Libra? Look, and this is your opposite. Look at the water behind him. There's a little bit, right? So you could be trying to fight and take the emotions out of something, right? You're questioning the foundation. You're questioning the emotional foundation of something, okay? You're questioning your emotional foundation as it relates to an experience that you might be looking at as a difficult one for you, okay? Because it's a four and it's cancer and fours are squares right and cancer squares you okay and it's the moon and we just had the new moon in libra in relationships okay so your relationships definitely have an emotional effect on you and it affects your confidence because the fours are talking about confidence as well because we were talking about the emperor being in control and being confident right power so you could be taking control of your emotional power, right? Emotional power is a real thing, right? I'm not gonna let you get to me, right? Oh, this new feeling that's being handed to me like this? What am I gonna do with this? You know? Because it is opportunity as well. It's chance, right? You know, and it's 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 allowing yourself to see where you might have allowed something to occur, right, within yourself, right, that needs to be handled or dealt with, right, something within your emotional process that needs to be handled and dealt with or needs to be completed, right, maybe a, a feeling has completed itself, maybe it's gotten its stamp on it, right, because the fours are talking about completion, so you might be like, yep, that's how I feel about this. Right, Libra? Right? These also talk about, you know, the fours do also talk about marriages too, right? Okay. Let's look at your Romance Angels Oracle card. <coughs> Please excuse me. Codependency. Addictions are affecting your romantic life. Okay, so this could be a, a codependency with a person. Maybe somebody else has a codependency. You know what I mean? And you were aware of that. You know what I mean? Or maybe, you know, honey, my mind is being blown right now. But yeah, you know, codependent relationships, right? That's that's Saturn, right? That's karma too, right? Because codependencies are, are seemingly karmic, right? Sometimes, maybe not always. But, you know, it's, it's, it's causing some emotional complacency here, this codependency that you're experiencing. And it might have to do with someone that, you, that has control over your emotions, right? This emperor person here looking off at this cup being handed to you, right? Honey, that little water that this emperor does have, look at what he's doing with it. He's having somebody come over and show it to you so he can get what he wants from you. But you know what you want. Could have to do with work for some of you. Could have to do with commitment. Could have to do with, you know, where you stand. Okay? And this could also do with protecting yourself. So you could be protecting your emotional self. And you could be just be protecting your own security, your insecurities, all of that. Right? And somebody might actually have a codependency towards you. Okay? Happy birthday. <laughs> 